Hello my darling angels, welcome to another video. If this is your first time here, my name is Jenna and I have an online crystal shop called Pretty Crystals where I sell crystals for healing, happiness, harmony, and home decor. So yesterday we went shopping for new inventory. Today, you know the deal, we have a crystal haul with all of the beauties that I felt called to bring home for us. These pieces will also be available today if you are watching this in real time on Sunday for our Divine Sunday story sale as we have been doing most weekends. So if you're not already following on Instagram at Pretty Crystals, would love to have you there. And again, all of the pieces will be there um, available for purchase for you on the stories. I did a poll the other day asking if you preferred the story sales or the website sales because I'm trying to figure out like the best way to make these available for you the way that it's most convenient and enjoyable for you. And also, not I don't wanna say like less work for me because I don't mind doing the work if I have to, but sometimes I feel like certain things require more effort and then they're like not as um, functional. I don't know, do you know what I'm talking about? You know what I mean. So I just wanna make it the most enjoyable for you and like make the most sense. So most people by a landslide said the story sales. So for now we'll stick with that. And yeah, it's very easy to claim. You just send me a DM. I'm pretty much always on there. Then we get your piece shipped out to you. I also offer payment plans. You can split any purchase over $100 into four weekly payments or two monthly payments payments so we make it really easy for you to get the crystal that you love of course i'm just honored that you trust me with this process of picking out the crystals for you and that you enjoy watching my journey here on youtube so a big thank you a big hug to you i hope you are doing well i know the energy lately has been a little cray cray i've been feeling very tired myself to be quite honest i had a little i wouldn't call it a meltdown yesterday but i had like a moment you know i just had a moment and i had to like regroup so i know energies can be feeling funky just know that you got this hang on and it will all be okay so deep breath it's gonna be okay we got this so before we get into the haul and before i show you our beauties i have a giveaway winner that i want to announce i feel like i'm very like this is like way too much space here right do i have to re redo this camera angle so a couple weeks ago uh, I posted a video where I included a giveaway for you YouTube only and I said I was going to be giving away a rose quartz sphere or a pyrite cube of your choice and first of all I said to write down one thing that you are manifesting into your life and it was just so cool to read all of your comments so I want to say thank you and also one of my biggest manifestation tips something that has always worked for me is that when I get something in my head and I know I really want to do it I start speaking it out into the world now that definitely doesn't mean just go tell anybody because usually that can work against you I've like spoken about this before like you want to be cautious about who you talk to about your big dreams and goals but it is important to get it out there like out into the universe whether that's writing it down in a private journal or telling someone that you do really trust and that does understand the magnitude of what you're trying to call into your life right because some people just think differently than us and it can be disappointing when we express something that we are manifesting and they're kind of like really uh, like they just like change the whole vibe and just like no not a vibe i just want to say like that was powerful what we did there just writing out what we are manifesting and i just want to say i'm proud of you and thank you for doing that here on the channel i'm going to announce the giveaway winner now so exciting let me pull it up here really quickly giveaway winner is miss crystal that is all uh the youtube name says so exciting and again thank you guys so much for entering the giveaway yay crystal Woo! okay cool do you like my new desktop i feel like it's probably 
maybe YouTube would deem that inappropriate. It's the birth of Venus, um, a rendition of it, and I just think it's so beautiful. I also now have a course for you if you are someone who has been thinking about starting your own divine online crystal shop. I created a course that walks you through everything that I have learned in my experience of growing a six-figure shop in just one year. So all that info will be below, links to purchase, um, everything that's included within the course, and of course, I'm here for you if you have any questions for me i would love to hear from you okay so are you guys ready to get into the haul i have a lot of beautiful crystals to show you of course be open to receive the crystal energy if you feel open to that and let's do it well, I want to start with the Lemarians because I have been so drawn to Lemarians lately and I mentioned this in one of my previous videos that I really want to dive into some research, maybe purchase a book on the ancient civilization of Lemuria and everything about Lemarians because it's fascinating and these are so powerful. So I found two that I would consider like Lemarian wands. This one is a bit bigger and fatter and she has so many beautiful rainbows in her and I just felt really really drawn to this piece. Just like a perfect size too to use in a meditation, um, to put on your body, to display as a display piece in the home. Just like absolutely, absolutely Stunning. This one hat. Oh my god, I'm seeing the craziest rainbows ever. Wow, wow, wow. I wish you could see this. I'm gonna try to get a video on my phone. Let me see if I can catch this rainbow. So I'm filming the haul uh, right now for YouTube, and I have this Lemurian wand, and I just wanted to show you this rainbow. Like, isn't that the craziest thing? So stunning. I literally like get brought to tears by this kind of thing it's like ridiculous <laughs> so these are our two beautiful lemarian pieces known as the record keepers so i would say if you are looking for some answers in your life like i am i should probably be doing some major work with these while i still have them it said that they can um answer some pretty big life how do i say that like if you're at a crossroads in your life and you're just looking for direction or answers, these babies can be a good guide for you. They're just like very feminine and elegant to me. I love, um, I love Lemurians. So there's our Lemurian babies. So excited to share this piece with you. This is a tongue twister. I would just call it Druzy Quartz, but they called it an Azez to Light or Soralite, Azez to Light, Druzy Quartz. I think I'll put it on the screen here. But oh my god, this one was kind of hidden too when I was shopping and I saw um a glimmer <laughs> of her and I was like, oh my god. Even the back is kind of cool with that like gray. Just like is there any more kind of princess piece than this? I also finally found us some acrylic stands. So for a piece like this, um, I would say displaying upright in the stand would be really, really nice. And yes, you know me and my stands. I kind of um, typically only go for the acrylic and it's been a while since I've had these. So I bought a few of these for us, which will be available for purchase with, with, <laughs> oh no with um, a purchase of a crystal. So I definitely recommend a stand for this one. Of course you could lay it flat, but oh, she's just so glam and gorgeous and sparkly and yeah, what a little princess. I'm getting like very like Cinderella princess vibes from this haul and this is another piece that kind of makes me feel that way. Ah, what a Stunner, she's so gorgeous. I love a clear quartz statement piece like this with all of the points. And of course, in the light, she's gonna catch rainbows in the most magnificent way. You're just like, you can't go wrong with a piece like this. The way she sits up is really, really nice. I could see this in like some sort of like entryway um, table. I'm just like fiending for my house already. I'm like, I'm manifesting a house. Like that's one of my biggest manifestations. And I don't know, I just, I visualize it all the time and the crystals that are gonna be in it. And like, it's just so exciting. So beautiful. 
and we have another one. Oh, look at this beautiful baby. You're so beautiful. Such a freaking stunner. Could, uh, maybe not. I was gonna say you could lay jewelry on this one, but maybe it's a little too like pointy on top. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe you could and have it like hang down here. But anyway, such a stunner again with like the clarity and the rainbows. And then I kind of love that iron oxide tint to it, which gives it a little more of that like brown golden color because I don't know, like that whole like beige nude aesthetic. I'm here for it. I love it. So yeah, she is a glorious statement piece i'm so excited for one of you to take this beauty home talk about like a decor piece heavenly ah. oh, my arm is like sore now from uh carrying all these babies okay i'm so excited about this one Whew, now that we're on the big clusters let's just continue so this is Can you even? This is our um, statement smoky cluster for the week. She is so magnificent. This deep, beautiful black beauty. Like, I just can't. It's been a very long time since I found a smoky cluster like this. As a matter of fact, like, I don't come across them very often with this kind of clarity and these kinds of points. And then, of course, uh, smoky quartz is much more grounding so funny because I was at a party recently um, when I went to Texas and there was a psychic there and uh, I was with a friend and he was like can you pick up anything on her meaning me and the psychic was like yes she's so grounded and in my head I'm like really like I don't think of myself as a grounded um, person even though I'm a Taurus and that's like a grounded earth energy and I do always think like it's interesting that I'm so connected to crystals being a Taurus like just earth you know makes sense anyway she said I was grounded uh, or had a ground grounding presence and I just thought that was really funny because I don't know if I do but anyway that was a, that was a tangent on being grounded um but smoky quartz is that one crystal that I am attracted to for grounding because I'm not attracted to many grounding crystals to be honest and I always talk about how my higher chakras is what I feel more like myself in like that's where I that's what I resonate with the most grounding is not something I like seek out I have hair in my mouth I'm so sorry <clears throat> um, since I got into crystals smoky quartz I have been very attracted to and I like that for me it feels like a much more masculine energy so if I do want to like ground in and feel that kind of like more 3d masculine energy smoky quartz is what does it for me so to have this as like a decor piece somewhere in the home would be beautiful and just give you that nice like balance of energies as well so yes would be nice on a desk too to kind of keep you grounded and present as you go through your work tasks stuff like that so oh love her love her this one might surprise you if you have been with me for a while because it's not a crystal I typically uh, pick out but I did fall in love with this piece and this is a piece of fluorite a purple fluorite to be exact from Mexico I don't know if you remember like back in the day I had these beautiful calcite uh, pieces with little purple fluorites um, like squares in them um, do you remember those they were just so stunning Anyway, um, but this is a big hunk of hunk of purple fluorite, and I was very drawn to this piece. If you've been with me for a long time, you know that fluorite has always been that one crystal that like I just don't really resonate with. It's like one of those beloved crystals that for me, I was just always like, I don't get it. Like, what is the draw here? I did buy myself a big rainbow fluorite tower because I was like, I'm going to give this a shot and like see what the deal is because it's supposedly very stimulating for creativity. Um, and I got this big tower and it broke. Like the day I got it, it fell and shattered. And I was just like, freaking fluorite, man. Like, it's just not for me. So I haven't really worked with fluorite, but I think it's very interesting because I believe that fluorite is uh, connected to our sacral chakra. And I was very kind of like 
not about the sacral chakra for a long time. It's something like I didn't really want to work with because there was a lot of trauma there, a lot of wounding. And as of lately, like I have been working on the sacral chakra, let me tell you. So that could be why maybe I'm more open to the idea of fluoride, you know, just not necessarily, but you never know. It's always interesting to think of those kinds of things. Yeah, like I am a very creative, artistic person by nature. So I think it will be good for me to, um, open my you know awareness to fluorite and see what it does but i thought this piece was so beautiful i love 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 the color i love the shape i love the size yeah this is going to be like a beautiful addition um to someone's home i just i just know it this next one might be a little bit of a shock to you as well because if you know where I stand with stands, uh, you'll know that typically I wouldn't do a metal stand like this, but can we just take a moment to admire this beautiful pink amethyst on a stand? I feel like one of the reasons I'm not into the stands is because usually they just look like disheveled. I don't know how to explain it. Like they don't look sleek and I'm such a perfectionist. I'm a Virgo moon and like I need things to look a certain way. Otherwise I have a panic attack. It's something I'm working on. But this one just looks so perfect. Um, yeah, I don't know how else to describe it. It just works on the stand and the stand is really beautiful and sleek. And the piece of course was just so absolutely, absolutely stunning. So this is a gorgeous, pink amethyst just so sparkly and shimmery and princessy ah i just love her okay next up when i saw this one i just fell in love i actually still have like two kind of bookend amethyst pieces from a couple weeks ago available so normally maybe i wouldn't like bring in another one but this one i was so drawn to she is from uruguay usually you can tell because they have the smaller crystal formations and that also makes it like just so much more sparkly in the sun which is glorious and heavenly definitely function as a bookend as well that's like probably what i would use it for so yeah that is our beautiful uruguayan amethyst okay excited about this one um so this is a piece of aqua marine and she is the most blue aqua marine i've ever seen yeah this one's a stunner she does not only sit flat but she sits up like this as well doesn't it kind of look like a um iceberg like that's what it reminds me of um but absolutely beautiful another like cinderella princess piece i feel like that's the theme of <laughs> this video but Oh, such a beauty and she has like this gemmy These gemmy pieces right here as well. Very like calming serene Energy I would say with aquamarine serene aquamarine color is un freaking real huh, So beautiful Last but not least I have these pieces that I could not resist typically i don't do the much smaller pieces anymore but i knew you would fall in love with these just like me so i'm calling them like our mermaid pieces or maybe like mermaid princess pieces i don't know but they are just so mermaid <laughs> to me and i got quite a few of them and i will show you they're all so unique but oh just like it just screams mermaid princess to me and yeah you could put these on your desk you put these by your bed so excited for you um to get your hands on these as well and yeah i think they kind of speak for themselves as far as um their mermaid-esque beauty <laughs> all right loves that does it for today's video i really 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 hope you enjoyed it so all of the pieces that you saw today will be available for purchase on instagram if you don't have instagram you can always send me an email i check my email very frequently as well so you can get in touch with me there if you did like this video give it a thumbs up that means the world leave me a comment let me know what you thought if you had any favorites and then of course subscribe if you're not already and turn on that 
that notification bell so you don't miss a video in the future. Instagram as well, just so you know, I always have an available highlight on my little highlights where I show you all of the pieces that are available. So if you ever just feel like crystal shopping, um, go there and you can see everything that is available and then simply send me a DM um, if you would like to purchase something or if you have any questions. Thank you so much for watching. I love you so much. You being here and bringing your energy really means the world. And it just literally gets me out of bed in the morning. So thank you. I appreciate you. And cheers to you wherever you are on this life journey. We're in it together. I love you and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.